Hey guys, for we start here in today's video, I'm going to show you how to factory reset your iPad Air 5th generation or any of the newer iPad on the latest iOS version. This method will delete all of your personal data like photos, videos, apps, anything you have on your iPad. This is something you want to do if you're looking to either sell, trade, or give away your iPad. Now this method, before you get started, you want to make sure that you back up your device through your iCloud account to the iCloud services or back it up to your computer using iTunes or your MacBook using Finder so that if you need to get that data back, you'll be able to get it. Remember, this will erase everything completely. So before you do that, the backup is important. So once you're ready to factory reset, it's really simple. All you do is open up your settings app and then go to general and then go to transfer reset iPad. You're going to click on that where and then go out to the option with a erase all content and setting the second option and as you can see here it will erase this iPad so that you can safely trade it in or give it away so you want to hit continue here and then it says are you sure you want to erase all content settings this cannot be undone all you do is click on erase and then the process gets started this process generally takes couple minutes to like 10 15 minutes depending on how much data you had on your iPad the iPad has to erase so once it's done it will be back to the hello screen that you see where you initially had it to set up the iPad again really important to do this process if you're gonna be either trading it in selling it or giving the iPad to someone else so they can use it themselves and all of your personal data on the iPad locally will be removed so as you can see here it will go through this menu a few times or you're going to see the apple logo the loading bar comes up a couple times one thing i do recommend is that make sure your ipad is at least 50 percent or more charge or connected into the charger because you don't want the ipad to have very low charge and dying in the process because the process will not complete so make sure that it is charged if not connected to a charger during this process as you can see here Sometimes it'll be quick, sometimes it'll be fast, this loading bar. Again, until you see the Apple uh, Hello screen, do not leave this screen. Just wait for it, which again, just like I said, could be a couple minutes, could be a little bit longer, depends on how much data we have. We didn't have much data, so hopefully this one won't be quick. As you can see, this is the Hello screen that I mentioned, which means our iPad has been reset and the next person can use it by simply going through the process to set it up so i hope you found this video helpful if so please make sure to like and subscribe button thanks for watching guys see you guys next time